guys. Okay, workout 113, 10 exercises. You will need hand weights and paper plates if you're on carpet, if you're on hardwood floor. Uh, use towels. We're going to be doing a plank, slider, knee tuck, and um, a V out. So if you don't have, um, or if you're on an area that you can't use towels or paper plates, um, you can do it as a tap version. So you would just be in high plank position and you're going to be bringing your knee in, tap, tap, and tapping out to the side. But if you can slide, we will be sliding. Okay, so have a warm up in before you get started. We're 10 exercises, 10 reps of each, and we will go one time through. I don't know how long it'll take, depending on how long it takes. Uh, you could always go twice through. Okay, so our cardio in between each exercise is a chorus line kick. So you're going to be using your arms, but the, the legs are in and kick, knee up and kick. So when you're bringing your knee up, you're going to bring your arms down, up, and then when you're raising, kicking out, you're going to tap underneath. So alternating, and we're doing 10, one, two, three, counting singles. Okay, so our first one is the chorus line kick. So one, two, three, kick, four, five. If you need this to be low impact, you just raise your knee up and kick out. Seven, eight, but I want you to get your heart rate up, nine, and ten. Seven. Okay, so our first one is a Heisman run, just in case you can get a good warm up in or if you cool down. So we're going to be running to the side, don't cross your legs over, side, and then you're going to stop and raise your knee. Knees up. One, two, three, four, five. Three, four, five. Really spread it out. Go across the room. Try to keep your feet forward. And I think this is nine and ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Ooh, I'm already tired. Okay, so this one is a weighted squat with a lateral kick and a lat raise. So lighter weights, standing, feet hip distance apart, squat down, touch the floor, come up, raise out to the side, and arms out to the side. One. Let's do left and right as one. Two. Two. Stand up nice and tall. Stomach tight. Three. Squat, touch. Three. Four. Four. Five. Squat down, get your butt down. Five. Six. Six. Seven. Seven. Eight. That's the way. Eight. Control. Lift up. Nine. Nine. Last one on your right. And last one on your left. Ten. Okay, put your weights down. And do our kick. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, sweaty, and ten. Okay, number three. Single leg pipe push up to a single leg squat jump. So we're going to do five on each leg. So five pike push ups, five squat jumps, balance, go down into pike position, stretch that leg up as high as you can, looking at your foot, you're on your toe, push up, shoulder push up, make sure your head is tucked, push off, balance, and now you're going to do a squat jump. So squat down and jump up, that's one. Down, extend, core tight, 
squat. Two. Balance. Squat. Three. Four. And five. Switch legs. Down. Extend. I want you to feel that in your hamstrings, on your toes. out. I want you to punch from your shoulder height. One, two, three, four. Actually, we're going to do singles. One, two, three, four. That's one. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's two. Stomach tight. Really feel it in the twist in your obliques. Breathe out. Punch. Two, three, four. Four. Don't just swing them. I want you to punch. Have a little pop at the end. I think this is five. That's six. Stomach tight. Seven. Stay in a squatter position. Eight. Nine. And ten. This one, I'm starting to feel it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm just going to get eight, nine, and ten. Number five. Uh, torso rotation push up. Okay, so here. High plank position. You're going to rotate down, kind of like you're bringing your hip down to the floor. If you can see, inside of this black. Hip down to the floor, bending, and do a push up. One, two. So if this is too difficult, go on your knees and do the same thing. You're kind of bringing your chest down and rotating side to side. Stomach tight. And ten. Oh, those are hard. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. If you don't want to do the kick, you can do high knees jump rope. If you're in a gym and you don't want to be kicking. Okay, so this one is a Marching wall, marching wall sit with elbow um, jabs. So come down to 90. Make sure you got a nice bend there. Lower back to the wall. Oh, we're marching to one, two. Pump the elbows. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 
nine, that's hard. And 10. Wow. I'm doing the workout the other day. Eight. And he was doing the handstands. <laughs> and he hit the picture. I think it moved. Okay. Now we're to number seven, commando push-up. Commando burpee, sorry. So jump up, jump down, or step out all the way down to the ground. Now here, your hands are by your chest. You're going to lift yourself up in one motion. Jump in and jump up, okay? Down, all the way down, lift, two. Or you can step this out, but strong arms, you're being a plank as you lift yourself up. Four, five, Okay, so this one is the plank knee tuck and the V. And we are on number eight. So, high plank position. Tuck your knees in, out, and V. One, two, three, four, five. Stomach tight. crunch, um, 90 degree double crunch, so ab work, legs at 90, elbows up, you're going to lift up and crunch to your knees, light hold behind your head, up and crunch, up and crunch, do a little tuck with your knees, two, three, four, working upper and lower abs, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Okay, we definitely have to go through this twice because we are at 13 minutes. Four, five. I want you guys to have a good workout. That means it'll be a 30 minute workout. And a good way to work this. Wednesday slump hump day. Okay, so do this one more time. So that was 13 and a half minutes. This will give me a quick upload, so it's under 15 minutes. So do it one more time, stretch, hydrate, refuel, and we will see you on Friday. Bye guys.